Boost. Boost is your daily workout that's going to be perfect for you beginners and intermediates. And every single day we're going to teach you something that's only going to boost your fitness and get you towards your goals faster. So today we have got an absolutely awesome lower body workout for you. We are going to work inner thighs, we are going to work outer thighs, and we are going to boost your squat today. So I'm going to take you through a few moves. We're going to perfect it, we're going to lock it down, and we're going to get ready for today's workout. Okay guys, so the workout's coming up, but I want to show you two moves from that workout that we're going to do together. First of all, I'm going to put on my weighted vest. Now, the weighted vest is only going to add more resistance, which means it's going to make your body work harder, which means you're going to see results a lot faster. So, put your weighted vest on if you have one, get it strapped up, and now, straight away, we're making our bodies work harder, we're making the resistance a lot more intense. So we're gonna see those results just happen just that little bit quicker. So, our first exercise is our front squat or a goblet squat. If you can, we're gonna add extra weight, but first of all, I'm gonna take you through the move. So if this is your level, then just stay with this. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your feet nice and wide, okay? So your toes are slightly pointed out. Now the move with this is not to come straight down, it's to actually stick your bum out just a tiny little bit. So as you come down, you're gonna sit back all the way back and you're going to try to get your ass as low as your knees but keeping that back flat I don't want to see your back rounded I want to see your back flat your head is high nice and tall in the body your knees are not coming over your toes and you sit so once you're back then when you squeeze it's the inner thighs that are going to be working so that's what we're going to be working today even though all of the glute all of your quads they're all going to be kicking in your inner thigh is the main one so you're going to come all the way down then drive up and concentrate on that squeeze on the inner thigh. Now, that's one variation of that move. If you want to add more weight, if you want to make your body work a lot harder, if you want to see a bit of extra results, you can add a little bit more weight. So, taking your weight in your hands, you're going to keep it at the front of your body, okay? That's why we call it front squat or a goblet squat. So, keeping it at the front of your body, again, nice and tall, shoulders back. Go all the way down, sit back nice and tall to where it's comfortable for you, and then drive up. So the extra weight from the vest and also from the weight is going to help increase your heart rate, it's going to make you feel a lot warmer, it's going to get your muscles working a lot harder, and also you're going to see a lot more lean muscle. So if you can, try and add, even if it's just a little bit of weight, just try to add a little bit of weight to the squat, go all the way down, concentrate, squeeze up, concentrate on the squeeze on the, on the inner thigh, all the way down, breathe up, all the way down, breathe up. Remember, you can always take the weight away, so try it with the weight to start. If that's too much for you, if you're feeling it on your lower back, take the weight away. Your next one is what we call a box squat. So you might see people using benches, etc., to do their squat. This is called a box squat. So to do this, I would use your couch or your sofa, you're going to sit down on your couch or sofa. Now, your feet positioning is very important. You're going to make sure that your ankles are over your knees, your knees are in line with your hips, and you're nice and tall in the body. And all you're going to do is come up and stand up. That is your basic squat. So you come all the way down, squeeze up. You have to make sure that you're not rounding the body, you're nice and tall, and it's your hips that go back first. Sit down, rise up. Now, again, the more weight you add to that, the harder you're, gonna, you're going to work. So if you want to add weight in each hand and go down, you can. But making sure that you concentrate on your big fat burning muscles, those big quadriceps at the front of your legs that are gonna be doing all the work. And that squeeze at the top is very important. So all the way down, all the way up, okay? So those two moves are gonna be in today's workout. So now you've got the form, now you've perfected it. We're going to go and do it. Are you ready? Okay guys, so before we take part in today's workout together in Sweatflix, I want to have a word with you about maybe feeling a bit intimidated. Maybe this is something that you think, you know, might be a bit advanced for you. You don't know where to start. You might just, you might just be scared. You might just be scared to take your first step. I get that. But I tell you what, I'm going to be right here with you. I'm going to be holding your hand all the way through this workout. All I need you to do is take part. All I need you to do is get up off the couch and want to move your body, want to try something new. There's going to be nothing in this workout that I promise you you won't be able to do. I'm going to show you variations, I'm going to help you with posture and together we're going to get through this workout. There are so many people 
on the Facebook page, in the community that are right where you are right now. They took their first step and they're starting. All you need to do is just have that little bit of courage just to change one thing. And that one thing today is just to move. That's all I want you to do. I just want you to take part in the workout, give it a go and just give it a try. What have you got to lose? So get off the couch and let's get this workout done. I'm gonna be in Sweatflix, so we are gonna work out together and I hope you're gonna join me.